Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new vlog. So today is going to be our Lake District vlog. I'm going to vlog the whole weekend. Uh, we're leaving tomorrow and we're going to be there from Friday until Tuesday. It's actually one of my very good friend's wedding on the Saturday so I'm really really excited and um, I'm actually a bridesmaid as well which is really exciting. Um, Olivia was actually my bridesmaid as well uh, when we got married last year so I'm really excited to be a bridesmaid and yeah bring you along on the trip. I probably won't film the actual wedding um, but I'll film around so I'll film on Friday tomorrow and then I'll film the couple of days afterwards and you can see what we get up to. We've been to the Lake District once before and that was actually for another wedding. Uh, we didn't really get to explore much but the bits we did see were beautiful so I'm so excited to go back. We're staying at a cottage called Southwake Green um, which is near Cockermouth. I think I'm pronouncing that correct. Um, so we're staying there for the whole four nights um, so I think it's in a pretty good position to be able to see a few of the beauty spots and a few of the villages nearby so hopefully we'll be able to explore and hopefully the weather will hold out as well. It's looking a little bit rainy at the moment um, but hopefully it's all good especially for the wedding. So I've just been doing a little bit of packing, getting ready to leave tomorrow and this part of the video is very kindly sponsored by Anna Luisa. If you've been watching the channel for a while you know that I love Anna Luisa jewellery. I've worked with them quite a few times over the years and they are just a wonderful brand and their jewellery is so so unique. I'm actually going to be bringing um, some Anna Luisa jewellery with me on the trip. I have some on right now. These are kind of my everyday pieces. I do live in this necklace and these earrings, um, but I have another gold Anna Luisa hoop earring that I think I'm going to bring to wear for the wedding um, because all of the colours are like autumnal. My dress, um, I'll show you at the weekend, it's like a gold really rich autumnal colour so I'm thinking gold jewellery, gold shoes um, and then it will look perfect. So Anna Luisa are a jewellery brand based in New York but they ship all over the world and they have very fast shipping so if you are looking for Christmas presents because I know it's that time of year coming up and um, they'd be a great brand to check out um, because they really do have something for everyone so I'm sure you'll find some amazing gifts. So they have sent me a box with some jewellery pieces inside so I'm very excited to have a look. I did pick out a few pieces um, so I'm excited to see what ones they sent and I'm very very grateful. Um, I can't wait to have some new jewellery to wear maybe this weekend and then also for Christmas. So another great thing about Anna Luisa is that they are carbon neutral um, as you can see from the packaging this is all 100% recycled paper and then the jewellery comes in these lovely little pouches. So Let's have a look. Oh, these are beautiful. Oh, these might go well actually for the wedding. So these are the Anna Luisa Harper earrings and they are this gorgeous sun design and they have a mother of pearl in the middle. I love them. Oh, I love these. I saw these on the website and I thought they were so much fun. I feel like you can wear these for autumn and winter because some of the colors are quite autumnal. So these are called the Hannah Hibiscus Sun Earrings and I just love the colors. Um, they come in loads of different colours as well, um, so if you would prefer a different colour to this orange, um, I think they have like blue and green and everything, um, but they are all hand painted as well, which I love. Um, but I think they're so much fun and it's nice to add a little bit of colour to your jewellery collection. So these are the Emmy earrings and they have this gorgeous champagne teardrop in the middle. I love the colour of these and how delicate they are. And then the last one, they've been so generous. Thank you so much, Anna Luisa. Oh, I love these. So these are the Charis hoops and I love them. They're more of a statement hoop, but they're still very timeless and elegant. Um, and they have this pearl detail in the middle. So a huge, huge thank you to Anna Luisa. I absolutely love every single pair of earrings um, and I can't wait to add them to my collection. And I just think they're gonna be perfect to wear in winter um, but then also when spring and summer rolls around they're going to be perfect. 
So I'd highly recommend Anna Luisa, especially if you're looking for some Christmas gifts. Any of these earrings would make a beautiful gift for someone. They really do create very unique and high quality jewellery um, at very affordable prices. There is something for everyone when you have a look. So if you would like to check them out, if you head to our description box, there will be a code there for 20% off. I'll pop that on the screen, um, but there will also be a link in the description box um, that will take you to their website. So a huge thank you to Anna Luisa for sponsoring this part of the video and do let me know in the comments if you pick up any Christmas gifts for other people or maybe for yourself as well. So I think for the rest of today I'm just going to carry on packing, getting ready for tomorrow and then I will pick the vlog back up tomorrow on our way to the Lake District. Hi everyone and welcome to the Lake District. So we have been here for two nights, we arrived late on Friday night and then yesterday we had an amazing wedding, which I'll tell you a little bit more about in a minute. And then it is Sunday. So I'm resting you on here because I've forgotten the tripod, which is really annoying. Um, I'm gonna try and be as steady as I can um, when vlogging this weekend. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd rest you on here um, for now <laughs> so I can tell you a little bit about um, our little holiday. So we arrived on Friday. Um, we had awful traffic. It took us so long to get here, um, but we did eventually get um, to the lakes. We got, I think we got back about half eight, I think it was in the end we arrived. Um, so we were exhausted. We just unloaded all of our stuff. We then um, had some food and then we went to bed. We are staying at Southwake Green Cottages um, near Cockermouth. I think I'm saying that right. Um, so yeah, we're staying in Southwake Green Cottages. I'll do a little cottage tour in a minute. Um, but yeah, they're lovely. Um, so we arrived when it was pitch black, so we couldn't see any of the gorgeous scenery around. Um, but we have had a little look today. Unfortunately, it is raining, if you can hear rain, um, just behind the window behind you. Um, but we're hoping it's going to stop in a minute so that we can go have a little explore. But it still looks absolutely beautiful. But so far, it has been stunning. So we then went to sleep on Friday. I then got up very early on Saturday because I was a bridesmaid for my friend's wedding. She got married at Low Hall, I think it's called, Low Hall Lakes, very, very close to these cottages. Um, and it was an incredible day from start to finish. I might insert some photos of the day um, as I chat through it. But yeah, it was beautiful. It was an old um, rustic barn um, with beautiful, beautiful surroundings. Um, there was just fields and fields uh, with sheep and it was really, really magical. The weather was amazing. It was really sunny. Um, hello. Martin Bell is here. Hello. Just filling them in on our day, our week so far. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was a beautiful, beautiful wedding. Um, so it was an old rustic barn. They had um, like a swing band, wasn't it? Yeah, uh, yeah, like jazz swing. Yeah. yeah, like a jazz swing band. It felt very magical. It felt very wintry. We were all in very autumnal, winter, rich colours. Um, I'll insert some photos now of my dress. It was like a gold. Um, I can show you in a minute, actually. And yeah, it was just a beautiful, beautiful wedding. Um, lots of dancing, lots of good food. And yeah, loved it from start to finish. So we were there yesterday. Then this morning we slept in for a little bit. Um, it's been raining all morning. So we've just kind of been relaxing. Martin's new video, A Brief History of Ratatouille went out this morning. Um, so if you haven't seen that, definitely check that out. Um, so that went live at 10 a.m. this morning. Um, so we've been reading all your lovely comments as well um, on that uh, video. But yeah, it's about one o'clock, I think, or maybe half one now. So we are just deciding where to venture out to. Um, yeah, I haven't eaten lunch yet. So I'm either going to have lunch before we go at the cottage or maybe we'll get it when we're out. So this is the room that we're staying in. Um, has a lovely little view outside. As you can see, it is raining, but it still looks so beautiful. Um, just surrounded by fields. It feels very relaxing here. Sorry, apologies. We still got everything out um, from where we've been unpacking and for the wedding. I wanted to show you some little bits from the wedding. So this was the 
uh, corsage that I wore and these kind of give you an idea of all of the colours of the wedding. They were all just like rich, beautiful pinks, reds, oranges, greens. Yeah, it was stunning. Uh, these pyjamas were a gift as well, which we wore in the morning. And then also I have a little uh, wild rhubarb and rose candle. This smells amazing. Mmm, smells so good. You look like a gnome. <laughs> <laughs> Are you preparing to brave the outdoors? Yes, <laughs> I might need a hat. <laughs> um, I'll carry on doing a little tour. So we had a little mirror here. Lots and lots of wardrobe space. This is the dress. Bridesmaid dress that I wore yesterday. And then it has a bathroom. Really great shower. And yeah, everything you need. It's a really, really lovely cottage. It's really spacious. I'll just show you outside as well. So you have a little mezzanine level. And then downstairs is the kitchen and the living room. There's another bedroom through there. Oh, still raining, still raining. And as you can see, it's just really spacious. So that's the front door. And then you have a bathroom through here complete with a shower and a bath. Another bedroom in here. So it has three bedrooms in total. Then you have the kitchen area. Living room area. There's mum and dad relaxing after a busy few days. <laughs> uh, table and then here is our view outside as you can see it's just surrounded by fields there's some sheep in the background there it's just very picturesque even on a gloomy day <laughs> they handed out these bells at the wedding um, and I think we're gonna put them on our Christmas tree So we have ventured out in the rain to a very, very rainy Keswick. Yeah. Keswick? Keswick. 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 <laughs> um, we're going to have a little explore, but yeah, it is super, super rainy. We've got their Christmas decks up. Yeah, look pretty. Santa's out on the balcony. So this is a chocolate shop. Dangerous. <laughs> Loving all the shop windows as well. They're really cool. our adventure to Keswick. It was a really pretty town, but it just rained the whole time, didn't it? <laughs> um, but we're back home. Martin's trying the hazelnut chocolate.
So it is now the next morning and we are off on a walk. We're going to go to Batamir <laughs> and hello. <laughs> um, we're going to go to Batamir and going to walk around the lake. So we've just arrived in Batamir. It was a really lovely drive and um, had loads of really cute sheep on the road. Um, but we're just heading in. We're gonna, we've just parked near a little tea shop. So we're gonna have a little look inside, see if we can grab a hot drink and then we will go and walk along the lake. But it's absolutely stunning here. Like farm tea room really lovely but we've done it in the wrong order <laughs> we've had our hot drinks first and now we're gonna go for our walk <laughs> yeah you could have two just about to start our walk but when you look up here it looks like a painting the um, the water looks like it's painted on and then the trees as well so pretty but yeah it it does really look like a drawing <laughs> That's quite a long distance. Oh. <laughs> Big step! <laughs> <laughs> So we're back from our adventure to Batamir and we picked up pies. some pies from that first little shop we went to. But we're back home now. Hello. <laughs> we're back. We come bearing pies. How's it going? Yeah, it's really nice. Hi Dad. So we had our pies, which were very, very good, weren't they? Yeah, lovely. And um, now myself, mum and dad are heading out to the coast. Uh, Martin is working from home today. Um, so he's working a later shift. So he's just starting now. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head out to the coast, pick up some food as well for this evening and then have a cozy evening back in the house. Do you remember what this place is called? Oh no, the, the coast we're going to. Wokington. Wokington? I think that's what it's called. Um, Dad scouted it out. But I think Dad mostly scouted it out because it has an Asda <laughs> to get some food um, petrol. and petrol. Um, but apparently it is on the coast, so we should see the sea. So we found the Irish Sea before we go pick up some food for this evening. So it's now the next day and sadly we are on our way home. We're on our way. It has been amazing. Um, the wedding was out of this world, it was so lovely and then we had a couple of days to explore the Lake District and we also just chilled a lot which was lovely. Butamir, that was just Butamir we went to, went that to Keswick, um, 
Sykes Farm. Workington, Sykes Farm Cafe. Yeah, I recommend there. Um, some great pies. And then our place in, where was Southway Green? It was in um, Cockermouth. And we went there as well. Um, so yeah, it was really, really lovely. Um, I'm not sure how much we filmed um, just because we were taking it chill, but I hope you enjoyed seeing the little bits that we did film. And we definitely want to come back to the Lake District. It is a beautiful, beautiful part of the UK. If you're looking for somewhere to staycation, I would highly recommend it. It just feels like you're in a different world. Yeah. Um, it's stunning. Very relaxing. Quite Very relaxing. Be real. Yeah, you think that's a good word. <laughs> but we are on our way home now, um, so we're driving through the beautiful lakes. I'm sure we'll hit the motorway soon, um, and then it won't be as beautiful. <laughs> um, but yeah, it has been amazing, and I hope you've enjoyed coming along. So I think we're gonna leave this vlog here. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you wanna check out Anna Louisa, all the information will be in the description box. And we will see you in our next vlog, which will be very soon. Bye! Oops.